under attack, what do we do? Barrier act, under attack, what do we do? Barrier act, under attack, what do we do? Indian act, take it back! 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 Well, Indian Affairs is uh, pushing us towards this Section 74, it's called the Indian Act, where basically we um, extinguish our Aboriginal title and uh, we're forced to to select our leaders to this system, you know, which is which follows their policy. That's why uh, we've been we're starting this campaign, you know, to make people aware of what Section 74 really is, because I don't think uh, not too much people uh, understand what that does to a community. We are up against a big fight, big fight like you could call David and Goliath kind of thing. You know, they're trying to uh, impose Section 74 on us. Why? And it's about derailing or not respecting the agreements that they had signed with our people, with our community. We cannot stop what's going on in our territory. You have to coexist. And one of the ways that we want to do that is by having a say on what goes on in our territory. Nobody can dictate for us what we want. Nobody can tell us what we want. We know what we want. And that's managing in a way that is sustainable and it accommodates everybody. And this is one of the reasons why I think the government is doing that. We select our leaders, not elect them. We don't vote. And we've never voted for a for a conservative government or whatever government that has been in the past, you know, we stayed away from that. We did not interfere in the Canadian government system. You know, they should respect our customs and quit interfering in, in our affairs. The issue is the interference of the federal government of Canada in the traditional governance system of the community, which has been intact and operational for time immemorial. And so, you know, and it's worked. That's the point. There's nothing broken about it. Um, the problem is the intrusion, um, you know, by the federal government and the interference uh, uh, on the sovereignty of the local community, of the local First Nation.